Hello, I'm back. This is basically part three of the um, series I'm doing on um, goodies that I got home from the uh, Creativation. So I missed this in the last one. You can see the, the reflection in here. This is a mirror. And this was in the, um, let me turn that upside down. This was in the cl uh, class I did for the etch-all. So just letting you know that was there too, but it was hidden somewhere else. For the make and takes, there. this was at the... Um, I didn't actually make these. These were in the booth that they were demoing in Thermoweb. They were de uh, demo demoing the deco foil, and I, I'll give you the link down below to uh, their video. This is from the Jelly Bean Soup. Uh, it was a make and take to do this barn door uh, shaker. And this was at the Catherine Pooler site, and I'll give you her link too. Beautiful inks that they demoed for me, and let me keep the card. This is a make and take at Altenew, where they do the layered dies instead of layered stampings. stamping. This is from Waffle Flower. Uh, it was a make and take of a card. And this is from the Dare to be Artsy, where they were, demo they were having us make a card using um, this, which is they have a die that cuts out paper. This is the paper in the background. They have a die that can cut that flower out for you. So pretty cute. And also with the Jelly Bean, they were giving out these felt flowers and these little mints. So uh, before I go on, let's do this. When you when you go there, they give you a bag full of, with little goodies in it and with um, uh, some coupons for some of the vendors. This was the scrapbook adhesives class I took by 3L. And this was a the Tim Holtz Ranger class that my friend took and we had an extra bag. Uh, but a lot of these places, if you just go to their booth, um, they, you know, they will allow you to have a bag. And this was the Thermoweb bag. Very shiny. The Chameleon pens, I'm so disappointed. I got the beautiful bag. I got the free markers. But the video I did showcasing them was, um, it was corrupted in my camcorder and I can't show it. Then this one's from Penelope D. There was Beauty in Simplicity. Nice patent leather look. And isn't this one stunning? The Carpe Diem bag. And look at that handle, too. It's just gorgeous. Okay, so let me show you what else I got. Now, all the make and takes were fairly simple, as you saw. But Bow Bunny, you had to go and actually register for the class and then come back for it because they gave you a whole kit like this to make. And there's a stencil. And all of these goodies came in it. Okay, Brad's, glitter paste, a palette knife, a flower, the ribbons, these are the um, gems, some poppet dots, and um, adhesive tape. And then while we were there, we went ahead and made this, which is the chipboard cover and all these pages here. They had the holes punched for us, and then we were able to use the cinch to put them in there. So then I used the extras that I have here. Um, that they've given me to put this whole thing together. And, you, you know, we could have taken longer, um, but I wouldn't have wanted to do the, the glitter paste while I was there because obviously that would have taken a lot of time to dry. So just flipping through to show you how big this is. So very cute little photo album. So that i really excited to do. Okay, let's look through my bag. Okay, this is what at the Faber uh, Castell... Uh, booth. We got this bag and in it was Grow a Little Love. Easy indoor gardening anytime. <laughs> a little kit. I think my grandkids will enjoy that. And there was a little flyer, Creativity for Life. And oh my goodness, look at this. It's a stencil. All these stencils in here. Okay, well, let's just, I don't want to take that time because I know I have a lot to go through, so I better just keep moving on. Okay, this is, uh, it's a graphite, a wide graphite pencil. This is a watercolor pencil. I love how chunky that is. Uh-oh, an extra thick lead. Ah, that feels so good in my hand. And then there were two jumbo wax beeswax crayons, jumbo beeswax crayons. And there were four gelatos in lavender in boysenberry, these sound so yummy, in butterscotch, and in squid ink. <laughs> so all that came from the one booth. Um, yes, puts all this back in here so it's all associated with the same company. And then Art Bin was handing these out. 
and this is a nice like you know little wallet thing we could instead of using this next year we could put our um put our id here and then you can put your cell phone here and a couple pens there and the, the strap is back here okay this was a make and take i didn't put all my make and takes together apparently so this is not in perfect order this was a little flip through album little photo album and they gave us all um, stickers and um these little cards here and photo corners all kind of have an Arizona and Western theme since we were in Phoenix. So I started putting some of those things on there. And then what I'm doing too is I have uh, printed out photos. This is a photo mat on both sides. I printed out photos from my trip and I'm going to stick them in here as well. Enjoy the journey, which is great because that is my word for the year. And you can see how you've got all these little flip, uh, flip through things here. So it's got some room here. I'm going to add some cute stuff from my trip. And so this is from Paper House. It's called the Flip Album. They also had a class where you could go and make one in the class. Uh, this was a hospital stickers from Scrapbook Customs. Scrapbook Customs. This came in, when we got our bag, I said the very first canvas bag, they gave us these Bob Ross water bottles. And he did have a booth there, and there was a... Embroidery file it says rough day visit bead and button show and then there was a hero band leather band leather um, bracelet kit shove that aside the um, pretty twisted uh, craft kit booth in which I in my uh, tour of them my video tour I showed you their mug that you could create and um, this was you could felt something so when you were really tired it took about a good 20-30 minutes to make this so if you're not familiar with felting it's very relaxing so it was really nice to be able to stop and just take a break and the Catherine Pooler designs I got a free uh, Fiesta Blue ink pad and I will be showing you more about her ink pads in days to come so keep keep an eye open rapid fuse glue we'll have to try this out that was a sample they were handing out this was from the chameleon uh, booth. It's the double-sided one and the color tops. So there's an orange and a pink there. Those are the colors right there. So that was being handed out. And this is what we colored right there at their make and take. It's really cute. You're one in the chameleon. How cute is that? This was also uh, given out at the ThermoWeb. And it is supposed to be, this purple tape is supposed to be ideal Super easy release, removable paper tape for taping down stencils and things like that. Uh, a nice sample of that because no matter what I've used, um, I still have some tearage sometime. And sometimes I use tape and I stick it against my shirt to make it better. Uh, and then glue dots, they gave us samples of glue dots in our bag when we start when we uh, came there. Heffy Doodle gave this out. Crafty friends stick together. And there's a little glue bottle. And it says, because of all the glue. You can see the size here. It's very tiny. And this little glue bottle fits into the hand of their little animal stamps that they have. Very cute. This ink and stain remover. Um, uh, Connie, who was with me, her fingers were all inked up from class. And they used this on her hand. And they got her uninked. And also Gorilla Glue was handing out a sample. And then there was a button company. I will give you their link down below because I'm sorry, I've forgotten the name. I'm, I'm trying to get through this. They sold buttons and sequins, and they had these little bags. And you, most of these, you have to realize, first come, first serve. There's a bee, a heart, a birdcage, little bee, so cute, little bunny, and a watering can, and a flower. Adorable little thing. I was just ooing and aahing all over their booth, so I will have to rewatch my own video and make sure I give you all those links. And the last thing was this kit, which I will do a demo on, and this is from Diamond Dots. Need, uh, the, the Need Heart? Looks like <laughs> World. <laughs> needle Heart. Needle Art. Needle Art World. And so this is a bracelet for me to do the uh, diamond dots on. So I will be doing this in a demo and give you whew, a review of that. So thank you so much for sticking with me and watching through this whole time. It was so much um, to take home that I ended up shipping myself a 12 inch square box. Um, I already put more in my suitcase. I expanded my suitcase and I still didn't have room for everything I needed to bring home. 
So um, it was quite the adventure. We needed all those bags that the booze were handing out because we were just getting loaded with, with goodies, 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 goodies galore. I do look forward to going back next year. I'm taking notes, so I, you know, I do a better job bringing you videos than I did this year. And I do realize that uh, my first time using that camcorder, I was way too fast and zooming through the images of these booths. So I just encourage you, if you want, really want to see close up, to replay my videos that uh, are too fast and just change the speed of the playback to 0.75. Thank you for watching and giving me a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel.